Okay, so real quick before we get into this video, I just needed to point out one thing. So if we go over here and check the achievements of the game, we are actually missing, well, we're missing a few. We're missing the golden spatulas, and then there's two in the middle, but that's for the chum bucket. And then we're missing this one, defeating 100 robots, robots as Patrick, where you have to... Uh, it's called Star Smasher, and we're 98% done, meaning we only have to go kill two more robots as Patrick. So I'm going to go do that really quick, and then we're going to get the actual video started. So we... That's why I love Crunch. What's up, Ant City, and welcome back to the final episode of SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. Yep, this is the finale because I mean, I mean, based on the map, uh, you know, all we have left is the Chum Bucket, which only has two spatulas, and we've done everything else in the game. We've gotten every other achievement that we can. We've gotten all the spatulas, all the socks. We turned in all the shiny objects, all the all all of the socks too. We've gotten everything that we can, so next, all that's left is to head into the chum bucket, and yeah, we're just gonna, you know, take a look around Bikini Bottom one last time, because we'll be saying goodbye after today, so let's go ahead, look at Plankton, Mr. Crab, let's, run, let's go look at our house really quick, before we go, let's just go examine, go view the house, because yeah, look at that, our street is down there. And yeah, we're going to say goodbye to Bikini Bottom. So let's go down into the chumbo. They serve food here, yes, but they don't yep. serve love. See, look, we're in here now. Okay, so actually, one thing real quick is... Oh. Flash! Authorities have confirmed that the robots running amok through Bikini Bottom are indeed coming from the Chum Bucket. Yes, right where you're standing. Plankton, owner of the Chum Bucket, and best known for the creation of robots whose sole purpose is to cause mayhem and destruction, has denied any involvement. And then stomp on your children! And stomp on your children's children! This has been a Bikini Bottom news flash. Okay, so yeah, we got that news flash confirming. So that last spatula, that so if we look at Bikini Bottom, we're missing one spatula. It's this one right here. So we gotta just get up to that one. I guess we just jump off of this guy, right? Oh, oh, why the camera changed? Like, oh, we can wall jump here. Yep, there we go. So now we officially, officially, 100% are only missing the two Chum Bucket Lab spatulas. We got every other one. We got all the ones in here. Wall jump in the bucket. That's what it's called wall jump again if we wanted to but and yeah, now we a hundred percent officially have every single spatula let's take a look 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 at all this chum chum chambalaya chum chili chum pie chum pie sounds anyways i'm not even gonna comment i'm not gonna get to you that sentence but um yeah we're here in the chum bucket now and we only need 75 spatulas we have 98 so i think we have more than enough to get in so Let's go in and see what the ending of the game has in store for us. Look at that guy! With that big square head and those short shorts! That's the most hideous thing I've ever seen! Wait! That hideous thing looks like me! I always knew SpongeBob would be the death of me! Chug bin jelly beans? A robot SpongeBob! There's definitely something funny going on here. And I don't mean you. Something else funny. Oh! Plankton! You're behind all this, aren't you? Yes, yes, it was me all the time! Behold, the Duplicatotron! I registered the name, so don't even think of ripping me off. With this, I can make a robot copy of anyone. I was going to make an army of loyal robots that would obey my every command. But they're running amok! 
I, uh, I forgot to set the switch to obey Plankton. Ugh. But now that Daddy's home, I can fix that. What's wrong now? It should be working. It is working. They're obeying me. I knew I shouldn't have made a copy of myself, but I'm just so cute. You've interfered with my plans for the last time. SpongeBob, meet SpongeBob. Hi, how do you do? Allow me to introduce my friends, Patrick, Sandy. Enough! Prepare to meet your doom! All right, so our final boss is ourselves. Oh, I see. We slam down on his hand, don't we? Yep. So yeah, we gotta fight Karate Spongebob as a robot. Okay, so we can't... Can I rock it? Okay, yeah, I see how this works. Okay, so we just gotta hit all those green spots. It's down, but what do we do? We hit point. I'm so confused. But yeah, it's just following us. I guess now we just dodge point. We can go down if we need to heal. That's good. We're just gonna keep running. So Plank, the robot Plank doesn't hit it, but Plank really was like, I'm just so cute. I, I had to make it lonely, bro. Oh, like we go down here. Ow. Oh. Like what do we do? We gotta. Oh, we hit Plankton. Okay. That is what we do. I was wondering. So we can hit him to, like, stun him. I didn't mean it. I'm so confused. What do I do? I think I'm. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to be hitting Plankton to stun him. That way I can do attacks on SpongeBob. At least I assume. There we go. He only gets stunned for like a second. I guess we gotta be quick. There we go. I think that's what we're supposed to do. I have no idea. We're gonna assume that. Oh, look at that! This bunch of chopping these platforms up. Huh, chop me up. Oh, we can hit him in the side now. Let's get him. Boom! Look at this. this is a cool boss though. I like how they actually use the karate design for SpongeBob because that hasn't been used. Since. So yeah, it's pretty. All right, so we got him stunned again. Let's. Oh, we gotta go to the front. Let's hope he doesn't unstun too quick. He's just chilling here. Okay, I'm gonna just hit him right there. I missed. Great. <laughs> Ow! I need to heal. I'm going down. I'm healing. Like Alright, that should be good. We're not gonna heal all the way, we're gonna that save some of that. Yeah, that's cool. So like the the phases kinda switch. So when I go down, Plankton starts attacking me, but if I go up, then the SpongeBob starts attacking me. Pretty cool. Okay. Let's throw this. Right in the light. There we go. Got a body this dude. So now I think we gotta do the Oh, okay, all we gotta do is hit Plankton. Okay. So, okay, as long as we just hit Plankton, SpongeBob will get back up. Okay. That's all we need to do. Karate! That's what he said. That's funny. <laughs> Karate! And he attacked me with that. Like, bro. Run. Okay, that should be all those. Okay. He's gonna do a big chop out. Alright, let's hit this in the corner. Got him. Now he's only. There's only two more. Uh oh. Uh oh. Get down. <laughs> Let me get that health. Jump up. This fish keeps. <laughs> Karate! There we go. Dodge him. Stop doing Karate. Move. Stop yelling at me. There we go. Yeah, this is a this is a cool boss fight. This giant robot. Robot. Oh my god. Whoa, he's like skipping platform. Right, big chop. How did he still hit me? I don't know, but. I missed! Fish entity, okay. Okay, commentator. There we go. Alright, so he's got two more hits. I only see one, so the next one must be somewhere else. I guess SpongeBob won't be winning that. Oh my get get up. SpongeBob is back in the fight. Yeah stop. Like shut up. Okay, look, he didn't laugh at me. Stop screaming karate at me. Move. Let me let me live. Stop chopping these platforms. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. It's oh. I'm getting hit. Okay. Oh. Let's just hit him. There we go. I fell, but we... So where's the last hit? Oh, it's on his side. I don't know. How did I miss that one? The one on the side of his cheek. Bro, look at how... Do you see him following me? Like, bro, get away from me. I gotta go down here. Go back up. I... Go up, SpongeBob, please. Thank 
you. That does it. SpongeBob is yeah, like bro. Oh, and this commentator face. He will I'll die. SpongeBob is back in the fight. Like yes, I know. Thank you. I mean, the commentary is kind of funny though. But all right, he's gonna chop me now. Oh, he's doing this chop, bro. Do the side chop so I can just hit you in the side of your cheek. I only have one hit. Oh, right, here we go. How do I get hit by that every time? Okay, this should be the end though. Get him. Let's go. Body him. We got 99 spatulas now. Ooh. Um. Hello. Oh, his arms fell off. Okay. About to body me. No, you don't to destroy my beautiful bride. We were supposed to get married next week. You what? Did he say married? I'll repair you, baby. Oh, I'm shrieking. No, Badrick. I think the robot is getting. SpongeBob, he just flew into your head! Well, then I'm going to follow him into my head. I mean, into my robot version's head. Which is like my head, but bigger and more metallic. Will you go already? Here I come, Robot Plankton! This is just getting too weird for me. Squidward, I agree. After Plankton said he was he was getting married to this robot? What? Anyway, a robot Plankton, I should say. Not actual Plankton, but he was planning to marry... Yeah, I'm, I'm with Squidward. Oh, there's a whole level in here. Okay, this is a fire design. Look at this. This looks so cool. Look at all of this. Look at this. And then we can leave if we want to. This is oh, no, we can't leave. So, yeah, we're stuck in here. We got to go for it, which I was going to do anyways, but... Bounce. This is such a cool level design, though. Like, look at that. The, even, like, the lighting and everything, which I'm pretty sure is just because this is the remake of the game, but look at the lighting in here and all that. Now, I don't know where we are, because if you look through his eye, there's like... I guess that's just a dumb bug. I don't know. Why is he making me face that? Oh! Surprise, what? motherfucker! Oh, ro I didn't know Robot Plankton was following us in here. Oh! Okay. I thought we had to just traverse. Okay. Okay. Now let's go. Bounce over here. We take out the duplicate drone, and then... I guess Robot Plankton pulls it back in. I don't know where, though. Yeah, body all those dudes. So that's why the camera's making me turn this way. The robot plank. What are you supposed to do about it? Actually, we can just shoot me like that. Do we just shoot him back with this? Got him. Is that it? I don't know. I'm just gonna head over here and figure out what this thing is. Let's see. What can we do with this? What is it? Oh, we broke it. Okay, we broke that. Oh, okay, this is here now. So I guess that's how this is gonna work. We have to go to these different sections. So I just wonder if this is a robot, how are there so many like float oh they have rockets on them. I was gonna say how there's so many floating parts. This is an actual robot. Doesn't make any sense, but it kinda does if they have rockets on them. What how did I die? I landed on the platform. What? Okay, hold on. Okay, let's try that again. Can I not land on those platforms down there? I'm gonna try it again. I swear I can land on those though. Let me try it. I guess there would be no point though, because I can't get up. So I think, I think that that robot's trying to give me a hint that I need to do this and hit the duplicate. Drone. Yep. And now we can body this. Now move, 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 move quick. Oh, the nuke gonna hit. Okay. So now what? Oh, now robot plank is here. Okay. And then now I think we should body him with a missile like this. Boom. And then I'm gonna assume those platforms are gonna raise up now. Yeah, because he after we hit him, he just leaves. Where does he go? I want to see. He just keeps going. I guess he just goes up there. Okay. Oh, he just phases through the wall. Okay. <laughs> Makes sense. So, yeah, let's keep going. And then, yeah, we got to break that thing now. So, I guess these are, like, all, like, his power sources we're breaking, it seems like. So, like, yeah, we just, boom. There we go. It wasn't a button. Push, what? Push, push, push. I guess that counts as a button in SpongeBob's eyes. Literally in his eyes. Because we're in his head. Oh, we going down here? We gotta do some bowling immediately. Watch this frame one. Get him. Get him. Did I break? Oh, I didn't roll far enough. Get him. That time I rolled too far. Damage, bro. Alright. That's that's it. That's the money shot. There we go. Body those two. And then robot plank should be pulling up. Yep, there he is. Dodge him. I don't know if this is how you're supposed to do it, but this is... I mean, I would assume, because it's working. So 
And now, yeah, he's gonna head back. Is this a giant plug right here? I just noticed that. This is a giant plug. It's not plugged into anything. I don't know what that's about, but we're just gonna head this way. Not gonna worry about it. And we're gonna head up, destroy that, and then. I don't, I don't think there's any checkpoints in this area either. There's also no way to heal, which sucks. So let's go over here. I don't know how many of these things we have. I'm going to assume there's four. That makes sense. I right, bodied that. Oh, no, no, no. Move, move, move. Oh, my God. I'm going to die here. I am going to die. All right. We're going to wait for him to throw a nuke. We're going to move and throw our own nuke. Oh, he's summoning robots. We got to be quick. Move, 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 move. Okay. Good. Kill. Oh, there we go. Okay. Let's wait for him to throw another missile. We're going to move and throw our own there we go. He's done. Ow, ah, Robot Plankton should be pulling up. He's right here. Dang, he was already. He's strapped. He's ready. Okay, Plankton. So this. Add him. Boom. All right. Now he's leaving. So now we can go this way. Can I get a way to heal, please? Okay, this one we can't actually go through those lasers. So I think we just got a bullet. Oh, yeah. There we go, got it. Can I get some no, some I... heals, please? I need a way to heal. Because, yeah, there's been no healing so far. Where are we going? Whoa, we soaring? Here? Oh, I think we're making it to the middle part. We're playing. I just, just kind of dipped on point. So what am I supposed to do? Do we just keep climbing? What is this doing? What is this taking? Oh. Okay, yeah, I think we just keep going. He's gonna follow us, but I think we can just avoid him. Oh wait, do we have to hit him again? I think we have to hit him again. I'm telling me. But that's the intention. Oh, he's firing at me from way down there. Whoa, bro. Missile for me. Try it. Let's get him. We got him. Let's go. Okay, so now what? Uh, is this the very top? Let's jump on this. Okay, yeah, we're gonna make it. I don't, know. I don't know if I'm supposed to be jumping on these like this. I'm going to keep trying it, see what happens. Okay, no, now it just takes me back down. Uh, yeah, it's just looping. Okay. But I don't know where we're supposed to go. We go in here. Oh, we throw missiles through these. Oh, I see. Okay. That's one. And then we go to the... So, yeah, there's like a bunch of holes and we just keep throwing missiles. I'm at one HP right now. I'm at Plankton better. I think I'm at one HP. I'm at two HP. Okay. So if Plankton pulls up, we have at least a warning shot. So that's good, but I just hope he doesn't pull up at all, to be honest. But now we go over here. Yeah, now I see how this works. Okay. So we gotta do, we're just destroying the power source here of all these robots. So let's dive through here. Pull them up. Boom. Oh, that was it. We got the last spatula. Did we win? I think we beat the boss. Hold on. Let's wait for the cutscene to play out, and then we'll celebrate. Because I, I don't know. There might be something extra at the end. I'm not sure. I'm becoming a lawyer. You haven't defeated me yet. I still have lots of robots all over Bikini Bottom. I'll summon them all, and then we'll see. Uh oh. I'll destroy you. You'll destroy me. I'll destroy you. I'll destroy you twice as hard. Oh yeah, I'll destroy you plus one. Well, I'll destroy you plus infinity. Shut up, you stupid robot! Who are you calling stupid? I went to community college! You oversized coffee grinder! Oh yeah? I'll show you! Come here and fight like a monster. Well, Plankton, I hope you learned your lesson. Oh, I certainly did! Next time I'll get it right! <laughs> Ouch! We won! Who wants to get ice cream? I do! I do! Need I remind you all?
all that there are still robots out there making a mess of Bikini Bottom? Sandy is right. Well, I thought she was a squirrel. I'm being punished. I don't know for what, but I'm being punished. There's still work to be done out there. Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy wouldn't stop, and neither will I. We can't rest until Bikini Bottom is safe. Oh, so these are the credits. We get to like roll around and stuff. This is cool. Rolling, so yeah, now, rolling, now that we're at the credits, let's talk about the game. I loved it. I really had a lot of fun with this. Just, yeah, th this whole playthrough was really fun. Yeah, but it, it's like a skate park. It's kind of cool. At least they give you something to do on the credits. But yeah, I really did love the game. It was a lot of fun. You know, it, it was just like, it felt like a SpongeBob game. You know, had a lot of humor, just a lot of references to SpongeBob episodes, which I thought were great. Like um, the inflatable arms on the giant robot, for example. That episode's hilarious. <laughs> yeah, they had a lot of references to, uh, you know, just SpongeBob, and so it, it was just a nice, charming little game, you know. Um, yeah, I don't know if I prefer this one or the movie video game though, because as a kid, I played a lot of the movie video game. Maybe if they do a remake of that one too, I'm like, if if they ever remake the movie video game, I'm also gonna do that one on the channel. Um, that's the plan, and yeah, this game was really fun. 100 percenting it's really not that bad i think the worst part is trying to grind out the shiny objects which it's just time consuming but it's not really hard it just takes up a lot of time but everything else like yeah it was pretty fun just you know i had a lot of fun stages like rock bottom was amazing that's one of my favorite stages i love sand mountain too with all those just the slides they had a so much like a huge variety of levels too like there was like some that were more puzzle based like the kelp forest was more about like solving puzzles nothing too complicated either though uh, obviously, the hardest puzzle in this game is probably that ball puzzle from the Mermelayer. Just, yeah, that, that one was hard. But, I mean, it was fun, though, because it was a bit of a challenge. So, it wasn't, like, impossibly hard. It was just challenging, and, yeah, it was fun. Um, as for the series itself, though, I was, I'm gonna admit, I was very inconsistent with uploading. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, I was very inconsistent with, up. Oh, I'm trapped. I, can I get out, please? Okay, yeah. I was very inconsistent when it comes, when it came to uploading. Uh, I'm hoping to be more consistent going forward with like, as you know, I have some more series planned after Spongebob. I just hope to be more consistent with that. I do have like a new system I'm going to try to use to try to be more consistent. But yeah, I was really consistent with Spongebob, which I'm going to be honest. It's mostly just because um, of editing. Like, I mean, not that I don't have fun editing. I, I do enjoy editing a lot. It's just I know it takes a while. So sometimes when I like... When I know I have to edit, it's like it's just hard for me to get started on editing. Like I like thinking about editing, it's like oh god, like it's gonna take me all day. I want to do other things, but then when I actually do it, I have a lot of fun with it and enjoy it. So, but I, I think it's just because SpongeBob, I was doing 30-minute videos, so that was it. It took all day to just edit one video, so that's kind of the part I dreaded. But I mean, I won't. I wouldn't say dreaded because I do enjoy it. It's just I knew it was gonna be t take up so much time that I just did not feel like doing it. But that's why I said, moving forward, I have new plans, and I, it should hopefully help me be a lot more consistent. Um, so, yeah. But, yeah, this game overall was really fun, and I hope that they remake some more SpongeBob games in the future. Yeah, thanks for... That's the end of the credits. I don't know if it's going to kick us out. Uh, we'll probably just leave in a little bit, but... Um, right, there's the logo. But, yeah, just... This game was really fun. Shout out to Purple Lamp. Uh, you know, everyone that produced the game, shout out to them. Just, yeah, this game was really fun, and I hope that they remake the movie video game, too, at some point. Because I loved that game as a kid, and I really, really 
want to play it again. Like, a, an HD version of that game would be sick. Like, I'm here for it. So if they make that, and shout out to Thord, Thordnik, is that how you pronounce that? I think so. I just saw their name pop up. <laughs> I'll give shout outs to the companies as the name pops up. Oh, and you know, not even just the company. Shout out to everyone in the credits who helped make the game. Just, y'all did a really good job with this remake. The graphics, like, graphically, this game looks beautiful. I never actually played the original, so I can't say how it compares for gameplay. Oh, and of course, shout out to Nickelodeon for making Spongebob, you know. And they're coming out with that new Nickelodeon fighting game, so shout out to them for that. Streamline shout outs. But, um, yeah, when it comes to uh, um, the, the gameplay aspect of this game, I can't really compare it to the original because I never played the original. But if they do a movie video game, then I can compare. But in terms of graphics, though, they did a really good job. Uh, based on what I've heard from other people who played the original game, though, this game was still really fun and still very true to the original. Even down to, like, the voice actors for Mr. Krabs and, uh, Mermaid Man, they kept them, you know, true to what the original game had. But, yeah, overall, though, it was just a lot of fun. Love the game. I don't, I think the credits are looping. Yeah, because back to SpongeBob's act, voice actor. So, yeah, we're gonna leave. And, yeah, so I'll meet y'all back in Bikini Bottom. And yeah, that's everything for the game. We're back in Bikini Bottom. And let's just look at the completed thing. So look. Karate. The small shall no, no, I'm small. <laughs> the small shall rule or not. But yep, we officially have every single thing in the game. I'm just gonna go through each area. You know, just let y'all examine it. And uh, actually the you know the thing at the end that had the mute with the music? That was actually the secret ending to the game. For being for 100% completing everything, so yeah, we uh, officially have 100% completed every single thing. After this, we're gonna take a look at the achievement stuff, just so you know, y'all can see that I have all of those, and then we're gonna send off the series. Let's actually walk back inside, you know, ending off the series by going home. All right, yep, we're in here, back at the house. Look at that, 100, 100. We have. <laughs> We only have two health left, but we've got 100 golden spatulas. Oh, uh, this is still on our wall. We should clean that. Let's talk to Gary. Give me some credit, Gary. Oh, he's, he's telling me to read the signs. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna head up to the SpongeBob. There is time. It's chill. So I do like how they ended it off though, with like the robots are still here and stuff. So it's basically like saying you can keep playing the game if you want because it's technically not over. But yeah, we're gonna climb up the ladder actually. Can we even climb the ladder? I don't know if we can climb the ladder itself, but I know we can get onto the diving board. So that's what I'm trying to do. Get on the diving board, please. We gotta jump up here. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, I know we can bounce on this. And then we're gonna dive into the bed. Yep. So, yep, this is gonna be our final stop for this game on SpongeBob's bed. He's gonna take a nap after we finish. So, let's go ahead and look at the achievements now. So, as you can see, let's go with unlocked. So as you can see, we have every single achievement. Let's go by rare. So we got 100 golden spatulas. Get 100% completion. I'm not going to read all of them, but these were just like some of the ones we were missing at the end. So get all the spatulas, 100% completion. And yeah, we got every single last achievement. I'm not going to scroll through it because you can just tell I can, if I hit lock, you've unlocked all the achievements for this game. It's right there. So yeah, let's, can I go by, yeah, let's go by progress to see uh i guess we have to scroll down because i wanted to see some of the ones at the end sock up yeah the, there were there were some more achievements yeah like spongebob versus spongebob was an achievement and the small does not rule so yeah the, these were the two we were missing and then obviously the 100 percent achievement so yeah we officially have every single achievement in this game we've 100 percented everything and honestly i enjoyed it a lot just yeah this game was fun and like I said, I hope to see more from the companies that made this game. I would love a Spongebob movie video game remake. Oh, I would also love Lights, Camera, Pants. That game wasn't really like a game like this, like a platform or anything. It was more just like, I think like Mario Party mini games. It was basically a whole game with like Mario Party style mini games, but it was Spongebob. That game I loved as a kid. If they did a remake of that and maybe even added some more games to it or something, I would play that on the channel. I would love to play the movie video game. Just th There's a lot they could do, and I hope that we see more but i mean we kind of are with that nickelodeon fighting game coming out so be tuned for that or stay tuned for that i should say but yeah there's just a lot with this game that are just there's just a lot that they could do but this game just battle for bikini bottom i'm glad it came out because it gave me a chance to finally play it and i got to make content on it but yeah that's all i have to say though we're done with this series i'm kind of you know it's a little sad that it's over the game was fun 
Uh, I don't know if I'd replay it anytime soon. I'm just not one to really replay games unless there's a reason to. <laughs> uh, with this game, it'd be more just like for fun. There's nothing like, like I already got everything in the game. There's nothing I'm missing that I would need to do a second replay or playthrough for. So yeah. But anyways, guys, that's it for this video. So until next time, look, SpongeBob's already about to go to sleep. Like I said. So until next time, guys, I'll see y'all in the next series. Until then, I'll see you all later. Make sure you hit that like button if you like this video. And if you really, really like this video, make sure you share it around to your grandma, your grandpa, your coworkers, your manager, whoever you want to share it to. And if you really, really like this video, consider putting it down to your favorites playlist. And just for this, since it's the finale as a special thing, let me know what your favorite part of this series has been. Your favorite episode, or maybe your favorite part of a specific episode. Just let me know what your favorite part has been so far. And let me know what games you want to see in the future. And I'll I will look I will read through the comments and consider maybe playing some of those games. So yeah. Uh till next time though. Uh oh wait, hold on, one more thing. Make sure you subscribe and turn on notifications if you don't want to miss my you know any future uploads of me of mine. Uh up next, uh I'm planning to do some Demon Slayer game content, the you know, Hinokami Chronicles, and then also the SpongeBob fighting game. So be be tuned for that. I keep saying be tuned, stay tuned for that. But yeah. Now officially officially, till next time. I'll see you all later, and peace. Have a good night, y'all. I know SpongeBob will.